Welcome back to some more AFK Arena. Today we're back on our YouTube account and we are checking out episode four. That is right, the Battle of the Masters. Now in the thumbnail, there are two masters that we're specifically looking at. The first one is right down here, which is Gwen. We know Gwen, guys, used to be a very solid light bearer carry. Um, still does an incredible amount of damage. A lot of players still do utilize her as a primary damage dealer, especially when it comes to the tower. But since we've gotten Morrow, we've gotten Scarlet, we've gotten a lot of other heroes, um, she has really kind of fallen down the tier list. And the second one that we do have in the thumbnail to familiarize yourself with is Mobis. So Mobis, of course, is the fodder food for the light bears. Light bears have more fodder food than any other faction, which I don't understand why it should be pretty early or pretty easy, but you can see guys, they do have four legendary tier heroes. while all of the other factions only have three. So those are the two heroes I believe that are going to be in this episode for the battle of the masters. So let's go ahead and check out the anime. All right guys, so here we are, episode four, the battle of the masters, just Asperia things. Let's see what it looks like guys. Start with the intro Lilith games. There is Asperia, battle-torn ground, light bears, maulers, see still go with the dwarves, the dwarves always still throw me off with an ear. And there we go, that's the first one with Rowan, we got Baden in there, we got Rosaline in there, there's Angelo. The world of Asperia, just Asperia things. All right, so a huge battle, big dragon. Very cool. And he is huge, guys. Look at the, look, he's as big as a castle. And there we go, we got Gwen with her bow. And we got Morvis. Gun is at the ready. Now there he looks smaller. There goes the arrow and the bullet. Bolt through the wings. Then of course drops him right out of the sky. But who did it? Uh oh, the argument starts. Uh-oh, now it's a face-off, guys. The referee's bench. Tied. Ten. So they're just tying every time. So the bullet and the arrow are the same speed. Night and day they're doing this. It's another day. And he's got a lot more tens. So they're at the cave. That's what I thought. So he's sweating it. Now he looks really tiny. So they're going to the source to get the answers. He doesn't want to be wrong. Uh-oh. They're putting him on the spot. Oh, 
Uh oh. Still in the big debate, the dragon faints. So still no answer on who won. Orthos! Very nice, guys. They're bringing in the time. All right, they're going to the cosmic scale. Let's see if he can help him. So turn it back time. There we go, so we're back to the dragon. See how big he is there, guys? I don't know how they don't see each other yet, but... Same time. Slowing it down to C. Did he stop time? Ortho stop time. Oh, they're glitching out. Orthos' gears are getting stuck. He needs maintenance. So now it's frozen. And we don't have the answer that we are looking for. So all of that, guys, and we got nothing. No answer to the impervio question. Um, if it was Gwen or if it was, in fact, Movis that went first. You know what? My money's on Gwen. I, I think it was Gwen. I'm going to go ahead and say Gwen. She's an ascended hero. Movis is a little bit down, a legendary hero. Um, I don't know how an arrow moves faster than a bullet, but theoretically, it, I guess, in the storyline and here in the anime, it does, guys. And I love this. Nomura and Dref. I, I love that Dref is just swimming down the water. We see some fish in there. Pippa, of course, is going to blow some stuff up, including herself. So very cool to see the anime edition. Again, guys, this is the fourth one on the Battle of the Masters. So we know, again, Gwen is used for a lot in AFK Arena, or used to be. Tower, still pretty good, but very cool to see that they continue to come out of here. And then, of course, um, Nauru and Shamira were the last one with Damon right there with Stitchy that was doing his homework, which resulted in... Um, Nauru actually going pretty crazy. So if you haven't checked these out, guys, they're up on YouTube. It is very, very cool to see the time and effort that AFK Arena is putting into these. There it is, guys. The exit, the AFK Arena. Absolutely love it, guys. Very, very cool video.